Imagine getting paid just for sharing your thoughts on products and services you use every day. With Survey Junkie, it's that simple. Click on the link in the video description to discover how you can start earning today by taking surveys. Shoppers have slammed Target for failing customers and forcing them to go to rivals after self-checkout changes. The retailer recently rolled out a new policy for all self-checkouts stating that they could only be used by customers with 10 items or less. While the change was made to improve efficiency and customer experience, since its storewide introduction in March, Target has received backlash. This has increased after some customers have been confronted with the removal of self-checkout altogether. Shoppers have reported huge lines for cashiers as well as some being booted out of self-checkout for having too many items while others have been forced to count the products they intended to buy. I've got to find a new place to shop, one disgruntled shopper said. Now, another customer has joined in the criticism by posting a video of their latest trip to a Target store. The clip even prompted a response from the retailer. On top of locking up essentials, one of the at Target stores in Brooklyn has now closed all self-checkout lanes, the shopper said on X, formerly Twitter. This is the line at 2.30 on a Tuesday afternoon. No wonder Amazon and Walmart are winning. The accompanying clip showed a huge line of bored customers lining up to go to the man registers. The line snaked around the different departments towards the back of the store. Some customers had even resorted to leaning on their shopping carts for support during the long wait. However, Target responded to the claims that its rivals would benefit from the change by outlining why self-checkouts were closed. We're prioritizing full-service check lanes so our skilled team members can support our guests' experience and provide a quick and easy checkout, the retailer replied. We'll be sure to share your feedback. However, Despite claims that the closure of self-checkouts will give shoppers a quick and easy checkout shoppers have said that lines are now four times as long. Target be like, we want the checkout experience to be four times longer, one user said on X. Retailers are evolving their self-checkout strategy in an effort to speed up checkout times and reduce theft. Walmart shoppers were shocked when self-checkout lanes at various locations were made available only for Walmart members. Other customers reported that self-checkout was closed during specific hours, and more cashiers were offered instead. While shoppers feared that shoplifting fueled the updates, a Walmart spokesperson revealed that store managers are simply experimenting with ways to improve checkout performance. One bizarre experiment included an RFID-powered self-checkout kiosk that would stop the fiercely contested receipt checks. However, that test run has been phased out. At Target, items are being limited at self-checkout. Last fall, the brand surveyed new express self-checkout lanes across 200 stores with 10 items or less for more convenience. As of March 2024, this policy has been expanded across 2,000 stores in the U.S. Still only gonna have two registers open at peak times, wrote another. We all know damn well there's still gonna only be one single register open anyway, a third added. When Target announced its enhancement of the checkout experience, it noted that self-checkout operations would be largely controlled by store leaders. Store leaders have the flexibility to open more lanes staffed by team members and set self-checkout hours that are right for their store, the press release stated. While the hours of operation may vary based on store needs, Express Self-Checkout will be available during the busiest shopping times. We'll continue evolving to match guests with the right checkout options so they can get what they need, it added. Our channel has contacted Target for comment regarding the latest complaints.